recording in three, two, one. Welcome to another episode of Dread Dad's Podcast. My name is Clint. And it's Mal. And we back. Uh, I don't know what episode number this is because we stopped counting. <laughs> but, Malcolm, how was your week, sir? Uh, I'm busy and I'm fucking tired. Man. Busy, busy, and you tired. Yes. Welcome to the real world, my nigga. That's what they call it. <laughs> <laughs> what you talking about? I've been in the real world. What the fuck you talking about? Not one of these sheeple? No, I'm not one of these sheeple out here. I'm, I'm, I've been woke. Say, I've been woke. I've been woke. woke a long time. I've been woke. <laughs> yeah. I've been woke a long time. Uh, Oof. How your week, man? It actually went by real fast. I'm yeah. very happy. Pay week always goes by fast. <laughs> <laughs> it's the week after that fucks you up. Tell me. <laughs> it's the week after that fucks you up. But, uh, I don't think I did shit. I worked. Me and my wife discussed having a podcast. It's going to be interesting. Yeah, you are, yeah, we are together. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> that's what I think. That'd be funny. So, yeah, that's on the way, possibly. Yeah, yeah. Maybe yeah. I should talk about edgy stuff. Yeah, I don't know. She, I'm leaving all the subjects up to her. It's all on her. I'm just, I'm just showing up, filming, recording, and editing. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Everything else is up to her. Yo, yo, uh, what is that? Um, yeah, Marshall, I'll let you do that too. Yeah, I'm just here. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just here so I don't get fined. Yeah, I'm just here so I don't get fined. <laughs> Very much. Uh, so yeah, I ain't did. I don't think I did shit at all this week, low key. I don't know. Been pumping out videos, getting subs. Shout out to y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Growing pretty fast there. Yeah, so I think that's about it, though. Uh, yeah, that's all I can remember. So, we got some subjects today, Mal. What would you like to talk about? Do you want to go big or you want to go small first? What you want to do there, Brody? Hmm. Go home. Go big, go home. Yeah. All right. Let's talk about Monique. Oh man. <laughs> I knew that was coming. I, I kind of I wanted to talk about it last week, but I forgot. I, yeah. I had like put it down somewhere and like notes and stuff. You know, I, shit happened. Forgot. I, mean, but, I forgot a whole bunch of videos. We had like a whole, you know, on YouTube. I, I put add to watch later and shit like that. Yeah. The podcast was so long last week. I went to the YouTube like the day after. I was like, oh shit, we ain't talking about none of this shit I had on the YouTube notes. <laughs> <laughs> we had hell of shit to talk about. <laughs> we missed all that shit. Yeah, we missed a whole bunch of juicy stuff. Uh, so, yeah. how do you feel about Monique? You know the situation, right? Yeah, yeah, correct, yeah. Correct, she, correct. she feels she like wants she more money. Get, yeah, because she's supposed to get more money. And Netflix is racist. <laughs> and sexist. And everything else is fucking fun. Okay. <laughs> if, my whole thing is this. If you want to argue the whole the whole money thing, well, yeah, I, I understand that with, like, with women and stuff. Because there, there is some instances where women are getting way less than what the yeah, yeah. males are getting. That's, I understand that's, that. that's history. You know, yeah. They in the same position, but women always get paid like a, a certain percentage less or some shit like that. Right, right, right. Which which I understand. I understand that point, but like, I don't know, Monique, man. It's like, when the last time you didn't stand up, though? Like, for, for real, because like, what? Death Comedy Jam, probably? No, nah, she does shows, but the thing that fucked me up is that she was trying to compare herself so, to, to Dave Chappelle, Chappelle and Chris, Chris Rock, Rock yeah. and um, Amy Schumer. Yeah. But my thing is... I mean, Amy Schumer not that funny to me. Nah, it's you. I mean, I, I, I said, but I she's, said she's relevant, those, though. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's relevant, definitely, she's definitely relevant, But this is how the thing is. <laughs> uh, for the people who don't know, I don't know if y'all know or not, but Monique was offered a half a million, which is 500K, uh, for, a Netflix for a Netflix special. special. And she said that she wanted more money, which is understandable. But she expected to get like eleven and thirteen, 13 like Dave Chappelle and Chris Rock was getting. Yeah. I think Amy Schumer got, got like, five mil. No, she got she got a good bit. She got a couple. She got more than that. So, uh, two mil. No, no, she she got low. She two got mil? low number two. Oh, no, okay, okay. she I think she either had two or five mil. Just like 
Yeah, because Dave Chappelle, you know, them got like 10, like Dave Chappelle got like 10. No, he got he got around like 10, 10 mil, 10, 10 or 11 mil. But yeah, that special, but but it, either special. way it goes, she expected to get way more than 500K, which could be understandable. She can get probably like a cool, for me, if I was judging, she can get like two, three, maybe. But shit, when is the last time have we heard from Monique, period? Um, because... You know what? You know what another thing is, too? What's up? Like, uh, it's hard dealing with Monique. Oh, uh, shit. Chris Rock got 40 million. We, we all well. We all well? Yeah, we, we off like a motherfucker. For the Netflix. For the Netflix. Chris Rock. 40 million. For the two comedy specials, so he got 2020. I'm just going off what she said. Yeah, so he got 2020 <laughs> for uh, two, so he got so 40 million. So he got 40, he got 40 million. Means, so Dave Chappelle Dave. probably got the same thing. Uh, Dave probably got, well, I don't oh, know. more. Probably, I don't know. Let's see. It's probably around, it's, it's 60. in that 60. So, yeah. So, yeah. It's in so, around. yeah. So, yeah. 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 <laughs> so, hell no. She ain't damn thinking. <laughs> no. My, my whole thing is this, this too. Terrible. Like, Monique is hard to, di- to deal with, I too. Think, I think Amy Schumer got, like, 13. That's she who, got that's, 13. That's probably who, who we got confused. I think yeah. Amy Schumer got, like, 13. Because I think she was supposed to get 11. But then she ended up getting. She said, "Well, nah, she because yeah, because they they lowball her at first, and then she was like, nah, and then they gave her a little bit more, but not mm-hmm. that much." Mm-hmm. Let's see. Let's see, Chris Rock. So it's eleven for each piece. So she got eleven. She had eleven mil. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to see. That's what it was at. I think it was at eleven. Okay. I don't remember. But yeah, so Amy Schumer probably got paid the least. Well, she did get paid the least out of Chris Saturday. Rock and uh, Dave Chappelle. Dave Chappelle, yeah. And this is when Dave Chappelle is on his, I think this was before, he, but this is when he was still doing the thing. He is, was, he was, Dave Chappelle has still been there. doing stand up. He's, yeah, he's, he's still been doing <laughs> shows. He's still been selling out. And he sells out arenas. Chris Rock also sells, sells out, out arenas. arenas. Like both of these guys do shows. Well, like, he's probably still doing fucking clubs. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that's what that's my second point is like, like I know she's not doing that many movies. Like, no, she the last because she did was be, um because like a she, holiday movie or some shit. Yeah, because she she like she she really because like if you ever noticed why Monique haven't been in a lot of stuff, she really fucked herself over. Yeah, she got it's because ball. like, no, no, she she got um she's known as a diva in the industry, bro. Like um, she she got it she like did real. The she most got it real bad. Comedian. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Whatever the fuck oh, that fuck came, came from. from. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. She but Where she came from. but she got it like real real bad, bro. Cause like um, she every production thing she's on and stuff, she just yeah she out she, there. Yeah, she just be out there. I she, believe it. Call everybody some skinny bitches on set and everything. Yeah, cause. <laughs> Cause like, <laughs> all right, give you an instance like for it. a lot of people that watch like Empire and shit, if y'all if y'all didn't know, Monique was supposed to be fucking um, uh, Cookie. Yeah, Bro. she was. Yeah, she was supposed to be Cookie. That was, but that was since she, way yeah, she she <laughs> and uh, what's his name? Um, Sam Darrell. No, 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 no. Um, uh, Lee Daniels. Lee Daniels. Yeah, early Daniels had like. Some words and shit like that, and he he wasn't he wasn't feeling. He didn't want to put up. He didn't want to put up with that shit, bro. I'm I'm thinking Queen Latifah and Monique the same person. No, no, no. (laughs) Nah, yeah, like, like uh, she didn't like he didn't want to he didn't want to put up with that shit. So like he didn't want to feel it because like every time she, every time that's why you haven't seen her in a while in Hollywood and shit like that. As far as movies go, because like she's hard to work with, bro. I was like, know where to put her at. Like, where you going? Now the it ain't even the 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 real, her somewhere. I'm just part, saying, though. like the last, last like real black movie was like Girls Trip, and ain't really like for a comedy for her to be in a comedy. The last movie it's that been, she was really been. in was Precious. Casey, <laughs> I don't know how long yeah, that's what I'm saying. Was. That's what I'm saying. That was like a while. That was like so, a yeah, I don't know. good while ago. But it's her ass and but her thing is like making this like a uh, racial a racial thing and a sexist thing. I, I, that's what I'm saying. I get. And then I get, she wants to sign. Everybody sign a petition to to, to boycott, boycott Netflix. Netflix. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. Niggas ain't even paying for Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> you know how I'm, I'm paying for Netflix. So you know how many people on my account, <laughs> <laughs> right? So you, know, <laughs> you know how many family members is on my account on Netflix? I oh, will <laughs> fucking say shit. Netflix is damn near free for a couple motherfuckers. So that, ain't nobody boycotting the shit like. 
What are you I, what are you offering after motherfucking boycott? And like Monique, you don't right. have your own channel, your like, own sub. Right, Some like <laughs> this is for you. Though. I can get if it's something like, overall. Like Parker's all day. That's all, that's all <laughs> thing she can offer. I'm pretty sure she don't got rights to Queens of Comedy. <laughs> and what else is that? Nobody want to see Precious because the movie. She, she's a co-star in that goddamn movie. That ain't her goddamn movie. movie. Yeah. So she's a supporting co-star, whatever the fuck the case is, and she got the Parkers. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> if she, like if she feels like she's the most decorated, you know, and that's, black that's, man, the, that, that's the worst shit to even say. I would say, I would say, I would put Whoopi and before assuming, her. I'm assuming I'll she said Whoopi that she got an Oscar. Her. I'm assuming that she got an Oscar. But guess what? Whoopi, Whoopi, Whoopi got, got all, Oscar too. She, she yeah. got, she got she everything. Oscar she got too. Oscar. She got. A, but then the <laughs> thing is, the Oscar is not even in fucking comedy. Right. It's in. It's uh, a some. It's a. It's a. Whatever the fuck I just said, not a co-star, but it's a drama or uh, something. Support, support, support and whatever, whatever the fuck, whatever the fuck it's called, whatever it's called. Uh, so yeah, so I don't know. I'm uh, a, like, look, look. I'm with, I'm down with causes and shit like that, but like, I ain't down with this cause. This is a dumbass cause, <laughs> right? <laughs> I'm be honest. <laughs> yeah, like if this if you would have flat out just said like, you know, dumb. you know, the whole pay difference, fine. Like I, I agree, I agree with yeah, that because it's, 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 it's like. People in Hollywood talk about this shit all the time too, cause like I think um, uh, I forget the uh, female actress, but there's a couple of them. Of what? Um, I can't think of the movie right now, but yeah. like, uh, cause like I just seen it recently, cause like they tweeting about it or whatever, and um, they're they're basically uh, kind of like getting together like this little uh, deal, uh, or, some deal like or some shit where. Uh, both male and female pretty much get the same That's gonna be same kind of pay and, yeah. and fucking yeah. So mm-hmm. it's it's already shit like that floating around like petitions and shit and, and groups like that uh, floating around. That I can support causes like that. You know what I'm saying? But right. like when you just flat out mad because somebody's not paying you like money and stuff because like you're not. You, it's is, like you're not relevant. She, she you're not part. She you're not to uh, protest them. Right. To make her more rich. Right. Like, bitch, is you, is, is you spreading the wealth? <laughs> like, shit. If then you ain't spreading the wealth, what's the point? But then, you know what else is killing me, too? All these, uh, all these people in the comments and stuff. Y'all are missing the point. Y'all, you spoke, like, it's people no want point, us though. to support all the stuff that, uh, it's black, no point at all, all, all our black men do. Why don't we support our black people? Like, like, one of my homies just sent, <laughs> one of my homies just sent me something the other day talking about, did you see this? And there's this black dude talking in the car. I think he said, what, what month is it? It's still January. So I think he said like March 3rd or March 7th or some shit. It's called Black Dollar Day or some shit like that. Black Dollar Day. And don't nobody in America post. All the black people in America aren't supposed to go to work and aren't supposed to spend any money on that day. I said, first of all, I have rent bills <laughs> and everything else. So I can't just not go to work because <laughs> uh, everybody want to make this a black holiday. You can't just make up holidays, people. Right. I'm, and I was like, shit, I told his ass, oh, yeah, don't worry about me spending no money that fucking day. I'm, a bro- I'm broke anyway. <laughs> I'm always broke in the game there. So, shit. Uh, so, shit. It wouldn't be a surprise if I sp- didn't spend no money that day no goddamn way. So, whatever. All I'm saying is, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm down for causes when they justify it and, like, it, 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 when sense. I know it's it's she more people sense. involved and it makes sense and it benefits everybody. I don't, believe, I don't everybody. believe Netflix is racist. Well, I know why, because they just released a couple months ago with um, the boy from the shop. I forgot his real fucking name. But it's a movie about, uh, damn, what's the thing after slavery? The Jim Crow Jim laws Crow. type Jim Crow law type stuff going <laughs> he said, on. said, damn, what's the thing after slavery? Yeah, no, no, you know, it's the slavery, then they signed the papers, and <laughs> yeah. then they still went through that process of, like, Jim having Crow white law, people yeah. and blacks living together and shit like that, or having have it function. So they just released a damn movie called Mudbound. During the Jim Crow era, right there, mm-hmm. can't be racist. Why don't they are sexist? Because they just gave Amy Schumer ass thirteen mil, and I'm pretty sure there's other females on Netflix that have fucking comedy specials. Yeah. So every point of... that she's making is not fucking valid. <laughs> yeah. Other than her getting a half a million dollars, that's the only that's the only thing that she has. That's the fucking fact. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's, come on. That's what I said. As far as that most decorated bullshit she putting up there, I was like, uh, she ain't playing the comedy. She's a legend was... in her own right and everything. But yeah, that most decorated shit, uh, no. Nah, you got it. Nah. 
I, that's why I said I put, I put Whoopi Goldberg before her. Yeah. Because Whoopi. <laughs> but she has to be some type of, like, she's not even relevant. Like, the, the last time that's we That's what heard I'm saying. From we her, haven't heard from her. And then, or seen and her. then Netflix did a Def Comedy Jam entire special, special show. And she wasn't even that. Of something year, <laughs> however many fucking years. If they racist, like, come on now, that shit don't make no sense. Whatever. That, that, she, that, she, <laughs> no, no, that's what I'm saying. That she shit, wasn't even, she wasn't even there at the special. Like, that's just stupid. That's what I'm saying. Like, every everybody, everybody that she was pretty much talking about, they spelled Chris Rock. They showed up yep. in that fucking De- yep. Def Jam special, and I was like, she came up in Def Jam. Yep, sure did. They showed, they showed a clip of her and everything that night. Right. It was yeah, like, but know. everybody was there. But Netflix is Netflix devil for some reason. Come on me. Well, I can tell you now, she ain't getting no money <laughs> at all. She ain't giving that half a meal either. No, they ain't doing that special. Yeah. They ain't gonna do that. Because what she should have did was just take that half a meal, low key pocket that shit, get her own cameraman, get her own crew, and then actually go do some real shows and get your buzz up and shit, and then come back with some more shit or something. I don't know, but That's shit, fine. you gotta make yourself relevant. This, like, uh, I listen to Charlamagne all the time. He said, he always said, this is the era of what can you do, for, what have you done for me now? Lately? Yeah. Uh, what have you done like, for me lately type error. That's exactly what the fuck it is. And yeah, I think you ain't did like, shit like Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm like she's hey, like that's, she's that's like, oh my resume and stuff like that. Oh like, mm-hmm. yeah, that's fine, but like what's 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 on your resume now? Yeah, yeah now ain't that <laughs> so no, like, no, when, no, like when you go to a job that. interview, right? <laughs> you ain't putting you, your you same job from all your from first fall, job. From fall, like if you ain't had a job in like ten years. If your first like job is still on your resume and you looking for a job at least 15, 20 years down the line or some shit like that. And you've been working since you was like 15, 16. And you about probably 30 or something now. That's a goddamn problem. Unless <laughs> you just been at the same place your whole damn your whole damn life. Like your first job should not be on your fucking resume type shit. Like that don't make no damn sense. Yeah, I'm just saying, man. She, I mean, good luck to her. I don't know yeah, what she's gonna do now. Her. Somebody might pick up. I don't know if nobody gonna oh her. Well, shit, she might go to Hulu right. with Hey, do your own special. That's what she should have been doing, though. That's do what she should have been doing. Doing her own show. To get her own film crew. Shit. Yeah, just do your own special. Netflix, your own special. Netflix was putting her ass on the budget. She, she turned the budget down. <laughs> so, shit. I don't know. Yeah. Right, you know, good luck to Monique. You know, stop stop comparing yourself and yeah. do something relevant. <laughs> This definitely made her relevant, though. Yeah, it did. For <laughs> it, now, it just fucked the money up. Yeah, it too. just fucked the money up. So. I mean, it fucked the money up. Shit. That's what I'm saying. She's like, and always like in those type of situations where she like fucks herself over somehow. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Cause then, cause like when when everybody found out about the whole Empire thing that she was supposed to be, she was like, uh, she sounded kind of butt hurt. Then too was yeah. like talking about it and talking about Taraji yeah. and all that shit and yeah. it was just wild. That was, that was a while ago too. That was like when uh, Empire. I, I think like a year after like the success of like the first season or some mm-hmm. shit it was when people found out all of it. Yeah, you know, niggas hate when you pop it. Yeah, and Monique ain't popping. <laughs> niggas ain't hating. <laughs> just telling the truth. Uh, so. That's enough. That's enough for Monique. You good yeah, on Monique? we good on Monique. You good on Momo. We good pat. <laughs> uh, next, no more big topic. Erica Badu sees the good in everybody. Oh, so no. much that she sees the I, good in good. I, I love. <laughs> God damn, it ain't that much love in the goddamn world. Yeah, I love. I love Erica Badu. I was like, she's like out there in the center. She's on a whole stuff. different level and everything, but. I get what she was trying to say, but she corrected, like, she corrected that shit in like some hours. Yeah, <laughs> like she didn't even wait like damn near twenty four hours. Then she corrected her stuff. Cause I had heard the audio, and like the reporter was like, I don't know if the reporter asked about Hitler or she just said Hitler period, but she was just like, Yeah, I see the good in everybody, like even Hitler or some shit like that. I'm like, yeah, I, I get what she was trying to she say. She was like, she was like, he was a good painter or some shit. She had said. she did some shit like that. Like he, and he was a, a lot of a lot of, shit. a lot of people didn't just know something. he was like. Basically, that nigga was an angry art student. Yeah, like so he had a, yeah, he was like a, he had an art gr- uh, background. Yeah, so and shit. I don't know what to say about that shit. It ain't that much good in no goddamn world. Yeah, I get I get what she was trying to say about like you know you should always even if person's a fucked up person you should always see some kind of good in the person. But like that was like you see, not a you good. Uh, good Baltimore. <laughs> you talking about Baltimore? Yeah, Baltimore. <laughs> 
our generation problem. I guess. I guess if you go back, if you go back to uh, one of those podcasts where you tell me, you, I guess help oh, the motherfucker get out of there. I was like, all right, all right. Yeah. That shit petty. <laughs> That's a petty. That's a petty. He helped. That's a petty one. He helped though. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. I don't know. Other than that, mm-hmm. yeah. Don't keep watching. <laughs> we don't have no news about him this week. <laughs> Thank yeah, God. I'm tired. It is some news, but I don't think it's, it's, it's news important. about him every other, every, every week, every day, every day. Sure. Uh, it's just so much you can only just take it that that <laughs> Yeah, just stop this. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, so I think that was all for Erica Bar, too. I don't know. She sees good in people, even when Yeah, a lot of people was to. pissed about that. that uh, I know she's she not. She, she kind of tweeted, too. I was like, yeah. I'm pretty she she high, man. That's some shit you say when you high. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you just talk too much and you high and shit. So, let's hit these news stories, Malcolm. Come on, boom. So, first news story is Toys Are Us. Bolson. 200 stores this year. Right. Uh, low key didn't know Toys R Us still you didn't know. existed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know Babies R Us still existed because I know people yeah, both, both of them and shit like that. Yeah, both of them kind of. Uh, but no, nah, I know like some close. stores have both of them in there, but I just I stopped. I really stopped seeing Toys R Us. <laughs> I didn't know they were even still around. I thought Toys R Us was like, uh, what's the store that's around like, that you gotta get rid of? Like, Carson Perry Scott or something like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Didn't Carson, Carson's clothes or something like that? KB, Co- KB Toys. And yeah, all, uh, all them motherfuckers. Uh, uh, what was that? Circuit City. <laughs> oh, shit, yeah. I think, they, I think they opened up another Circuit City. No, they didn't. Oh, they opened bring, oh, they, them oh, back. bring them back. Yeah, I don't see no point of that shit. Back. That shit gonna close right back the fuck down. <laughs> I don't know why they shopped at Circuit City. I obviously didn't know why they shopped at Circuit City the first fucking time around. So I don't even get the point of that shit. Yeah, but uh, I know there's a couple of them in the city that's uh, closing in the next month or so. So I guess some of you people can uh, get your get your coupons and shit ready. Get them half. Uh, they did it at the wrong. Uh, they probably did it at the well. No, it's tax time. It's that tax shit. time. If, yeah, it, that's if right. it was Christmas, if it was Christmas time or something like that, a little bit before Christmas, boy, that shit would have been. Oh, they probably they probably, gonna, they gonna <laughs> probably put them uh, <laughs> prices up a little bit. Yeah. On them closing deals and shit, cause they know people gonna be up in there trying to buy Lego sets and all that shit. Yeah. Do kids even play with toys still? Well, my kids kind of play with toys, kind of. I mean, Toys R Us is Toys R Us is over uh, overrated and over expensive. Yeah, like like a motherfucker. That's why they didn't close. Yeah. (laughs) And plus, everybody like what what kind of killed Toys R Us was like they didn't take advantage of that whole online shopping shit. When you know when people yeah, yeah, yeah. started buying shit off of Amazon, that's how Amazon, mm-hmm. you know, kind of launched Came further. Off. Yeah, because um, you know deals, people baby. people was buying shit offline and it's cheaper. So Toys R Us, that was they fault. So I know whoever they marketing the team is kicking themselves in their ass or something. Yeah, about that. Like man, we should have had an online market because like they they online market was to basically give it to fucking Amazon. <laughs> It's like, all right, we gonna it sell should, through Amazon. Been, that's uh, stupid, damn <laughs> right? That's stupid. <laughs> you losing, you losing money for yourself. I was looking for the fucking story because we was already talking about Amazon, but I don't know what the fuck is that. But anyway, um, so Amazon opened their first Amazon Go Shop store, like the grocery oh, store. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, You don't have to check, check out, out shit. You basically, and yeah, motherfuckers already shoplifting. Oh, I already knew that was. But coming. guess what though? What's that? It catch their ass. Uh, <laughs> you wanna know how they catch me though? The, the way they the catch me is so slick. Yeah, they charge your account. <laughs> I don't know how the fuck they did. I read the story this morning. Yeah, but uh, uh, some lady she had took or somebody had took some shit and it got later on charged to her account. <laughs> but then she was like, I still got this yoga for free, and she um, I, guess, I think she tagged the uh, or the she yoga. added the on Twitter. She added the people, the yoga company, or whatever. She's like, they was like, they retweeted, they tweeted her back. They're like, no, nah, this one's on us. Don't worry about it. And he's like, no, this one's on Amazon. <laughs> I was like, just shut the fuck up and take the yogurt. The fuck did you <laughs> try to make yourself a fucking criminal for? Well, but stupid stuff. But man. motherfucker got. I don't. I don't even want to say they getting caught, but I don't even. I don't. And <laughs> something else funny about this whole story. The whole point of the store is to not have to wait in line and just go in and yeah, because you're shit. supposed to just go and but grab what you But the thing is, it's a line to get to the fucking grocery store now. <laughs> so it's just even worse. <laughs> There's literally this dude tweeting a picture talking about 
I know the whole point of the store is to eliminate lines at the cashier, but goddamn it, we're still in lines yeah, to get the goddamn store. store. That's funny. <laughs> so, like, now you have to wait in line to get to the fucking grocery store. Like, that's the dumbest shit in the fucking world. Like, and it's in Seattle, so I think that's where the headquarters is or something like that, I think. Yeah, because I know that first, because you're supposed to be able to, when you go through the store, it's like you, a, you, you can, can like, yeah, and you take a picture or something like that. Take a picture of your items like and, like, you got, like, a whole shopping cart on your phone and shit yeah. like that, and then. Like you check, you literally check out on your phone, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or you go, or or yeah. like um, the the items that you had mm-hmm. or scanned or whatever, you just go right out through the door and it charges you whatever you picked up and shit. That's that's how my fuck got caught <laughs> shoplifting. It's not really shoplifting because you still getting caught. You bought it in your bag. Yeah, <laughs> you just walking out and just getting charged with your fucking <laughs> Amazon account. So I don't see the fucking big difference, but yeah, and got y'all done. Man. Um, what else we got to talk about? Uh, what else we got to news? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, oh yeah, monkey clones. Have you seen that? Monkey clones. Monkeys. They clone monkeys, like some baby monkeys. I know. I I knew they was cloning mice and yeah, they 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 cloning mice, uh, sheep. Yeah, I remember the sheep, but the Uh, sheep like died, like. Weeks or something so later. They, so they clone some later. monkeys. Um, That's kind of getting close. They know they've been cloning chickens and shit too, though, too, too right? They clone yeah, chickens. It's called, it's called uh, Turkish chicken. <laughs> <laughs> I don't eat that shit. <laughs> I stay away from that shit. Yeah. That's clone chicken, yeah. Uh, so yeah, they cloning monkeys and shit. Um, yeah, that's why I said that's kind of that's kind of close. Getting close, getting close, getting close, close. Yeah. <laughs> I say that's kind of yeah, that's damn near close. What would you do with a clone, Malcolm? <laughs> Man. Everything that I, I don't want to do. Right. <laughs> that man. Uh, what's, what's the, uh, the episode of Family Guy? What the fuck did he call his clone? Uh, uh, it wasn't stupid, Stu. It was, it was something else. Uh, <laughs> I forget what he called it. I think it was like retarded. Retarded. It was some shit. But you know, Stu, we got a clone and shit. And then he was like, you know what? His I'm going to make you one, Brian. Right? <laughs> <laughs> and then they started falling apart and shit like that. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot what the fuck they even called their ass. Yeah, he was pew. Yeah, we're getting, we getting close that close enough. We finna get cloned. Yeah, you I'm know what I did? Shit, I... Stay my ass home. My, yeah, <laughs> I would stay home. My my clone would take his ass to work for exactly. me. Exactly. I was like, yeah, you. I need three of them. I'm like, you can go I need, work I need, these three I need, jobs. I need three of them on stat, oh, speed down. <laughs> <laughs> and just give me all the money. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, that's some other news. Uh, like, hey, I wonder, what's up? Will people be able to file their clones <laughs> if you take care of them? Can you file them? I mean, you take care of them. <laughs> <laughs> you file them as you're independent. I'm, I'm wondering. <laughs> you don't think that's a good? You want to file your clones independent? Hell yeah! He's only two days old. Like, what the fuck? Why? Why? <laughs> Why the hell can I? I can't claim my I can't claim my own self. They come with their own social security cards and shit. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, they probably have to do a, a number off of the like the original or some shit. So it'd have to be like mine and then dash one yeah, clone uh, one or some shit. Clone two, clone that'd three. Be funny. That's funny as fuck. Oh man. <laughs> Uh, I'm pretty so, sure they probably getting shit together because they probably already think yeah, that, uh, like, that, like, that, like that. Like that. Uh, what's that shit we they watch that's coming on Netflix? Uh, Alton uh, Car- Carbon uh, or something uh, yeah. like Carbon Alton. Alton whatever the fuck, what the fuck that shit called? Carbon. Yeah, whatever the fuck that shit called. That, that's on the way. <laughs> <laughs> getting them clones ready. Transfer the minds. Um, something else. A nine year old accidentally shared his grandpa's marijuana gummies with his fifth grade class. Oh man, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no kids, but now how do you <laughs> uh, I don't know how shit like this happens. It's just a result of kids still in camp. <laughs> just still in shit. Just still in shit. <laughs> still in yeah, shit. Yeah, it's the first school. time I heard that, too. No, like yeah, that, I, pretty, uh, I know it happened. It I know it happened a couple too. times. I've heard this type of shit before, too. I was like, man. It's like, uh, kids be leaving them kids, well. leaving candy around the kids thinking, oh, man, I done came up. Yeah. <laughs> I got these gummies. I got my juice box. I'm ready to go, boy. Lunch gonna be lit. <laughs> for, for real. For real. No fun intended. Literally. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, well, that's some shit that happened. Also, uh, this story might be a little weird. 
it was to me a little bit just because how some of the words were. So Vice did a story with uh, what's this motherfucker's name? God damn it! I was waiting for his name in the first fucking thing. I don't know. All right, but the guy, the black guy that did Barney back oh, in the day, guy did Barney. He has a sex ring. Well, a new sex business. What? Dash ring. That's what he does. You said a sex ring? Ring. A sex ring. Like yeah. a fighting ring? No, nigga. Like a... Or like... Like, like a, Oh, yeah. That's, <laughs> that was my next thing. <laughs> like <Arkell>. No. Was, <laughs> like, <laughs> I didn't want to go there at first. It's, not, like, it's not underage girls, but it's, you know, a sex ring. Like R. Kelly. Oh, so you basically... You had that. Something like that. Uh, so the whole story is... Uh, so Vice did this story. They interviewed him, and he has a tantric sex business. So he does um, yoga, therapeutic uh, yoga type things, sex, sensual massages. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a real, it's some weird words in here. So they interviewed him, right? And he was like, when the lingam, <laughs> they put parentheses, penis. Because <laughs> the lingam is called the penis. The lingam is a penis. I don't know why. I, I don't know what other words <laughs> goes on with these. And the yoni, meat. The yoni is the vagina. <laughs> It's weird as fuck. <laughs> the whole story is weird, by the way. <laughs> Just so you know. And he was like, um, when they meet at a certain place, um, what the fuck does it say? There's a certain energy, energy that takes place that hands and body alone cannot create. Yeah, it's called fucking. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> so he had, I think he had like he has like 30 or 35 women or something like that. That's crazy. This is his name. This is his name. David Joyner. That's his fucking name. And... These sessions last from three to four hours and cost us three hundred fifty dollars. And he has like thirty, thirty-five women in his little circle that that's does crazy. Type of shit. You know, that's just as crazy as um, uh, what is they call? Bunny wrench? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> uh, it's it's uh, it's like they like hugging buddies, like you pack like. Oh yeah, people get paid to like guys, guys, yeah, cut a buddy and shit. Yeah, Yeah, like you, like people get paid to like. No, but he's actually having sex with these women, but it's called therapeutic and yoga type shit. Sounds like (laughs) prostitution. It's called. It's not even prostitution. They're paying. Well, I guess. On his yeah, behalf. Man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> That's what I said. Sound yeah, like prostitution. Yeah, you might be right, yeah. It's a fancy word for prostitution. Yeah, you might be right. <laughs> and, See, I, if he had know, camera so, if he had cram- cameras involved, then it'd be porn. So you step it up. Step up. It's a step up. <laughs> you can go viral. Uh he said it was something here that was like weird as fuck though. Um oh, here you go, here you go. Alright, so oh, is this it? Yeah, this is it. Okay. So he compared this shit. He compared the way he's doing now to like his Barney, the Barney show. Jesus Christ. <laughs> it made it weird. All right, so it said, this is quotations, people. So, it's, before I got into the Barney costume, I would pray and ask God to allow his loving divine spirit to flow through me, through the costume, and let that draw the kids. That energy would also draw them in. Children are more connected spiritually than adults. A lot of times when, it, when I see infants and I'm out and about, uh, when I'm out and about at the grocery store or whatever, they start staring at me. I make a joke. You know who I am. <laughs> it was something else in here weird too. He made he made a couple comments like, "Oh man, is this it? Uh, the energy I brought in the costume? Nah, this ain't it. I don't know." But he made a he made he said some weird ass shit like comparing like the way he's doing out to like putting on the Barney costume and performing and whatever around all the kids and shit. I was like, this shit is gonna go left eventually. <laughs> it's gonna be a bad time. <laughs> Before this shit goes left. What city is this? And then the, I think then the Elmo, the dude that plays Elmo, didn't he have like like some other weird shit going on with him too? Uh, he got what? I forgot yeah, what the fuck that was. But I think nah, he, he got, got some weird he got too. A, he got accused of stuff, and then like he was cleared of it, but nobody didn't really like release any news saying that he was like cleared of like the mm-hmm. uh, sexual. Uh, charges of or misconduct or whatever. Or whatever. Yeah, I, th- I thought he had probably did something. Because like it was a whole, it was like a whole doc after that released. Yeah. I forgot what the fuck happened with that. Uh, something else, Malcolm. Back in that VR sex doll territory. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, there is an adult cam site called Cam Soda that will offer virtual intercourse with real people. 
using a sex doll in VR. <laughs> oh, they using a the sex doll. Because before... They still using a sex doll, and they just had the VR. I guess it, this is just this is the cheap version of the $10,000 version. Because, <laughs> you know, before before they had Cam, Cam so that they had, uh, a, a, I want to say, like, I guess it's one of those, like, uh, vagina plushies or whatever. But it, it, it was <laughs> like it was something like that, but um, it conforms to the vagina of the cam person. Oh, okay. Oh, so it, it, it'll, it'll mold, it'll mold, mold for you, like, yeah. You it'll mold, penis, all that type of shit. it'll mold the size of the person that's like the cam person on the other side because, oh, like, it was a okay. It was another version. I, I don't know how far they got with that thing, but I remember hearing that a little, like maybe two, a year or two ago. Yeah. And um. This is weird. Yeah. So the other guy. <laughs> so the other the other half of it, the guy when he sticks this thing in there, she, like he can somewhat feel her, and then she she could feel him. It was like it, it was like it was like weird. I was like, man, that's some old crazy. Either just get a real woman, woman, or you know. I don't know what to tell y'all. <laughs> virtual sex can't be that good. <laughs> I'm pretty sure virtual sex isn't better than real sex. <laughs> no way in hell. <laughs> that's, that's, real, that's better than real sex. I don't know. Um, that's crazy. Oh, yeah. we uh, I forgot about this. We were just talking about women. This is like a kind of women-based episode. <laughs> uh, Wendy Williams. She said she is sick and tired of this Me Too movement. And I'm sick and tired of her. I, I don't fuck with Wendy Williams. I don't like her, period. <laughs> yeah, you know, my, well, my, my mother is, and my loves her. I hate, I hate Wendy Williams. Yeah, I don't, I don't. I, I don't well, hate is such a strong purpose. word. I don't, I don't. I just don't feel purpose. She just does what. She just likes the fucking like a, star a, shit. A blog gossip. would do. She yeah. just started a blog. Like, she just shouldn't have a whole TV show just talking about other people's business. Yeah, because like. <laughs> That's all she really does. And then like, what be tripping me out, she be. She's so fucking fake, Because, like, she'll invite people over. Like, she'll talk shit. Yeah. Like, a day before, she'll talk I, shit I about watching, the person. Have them on their show. And then talk watching. talk more shit about them when they leave. Nigga, I was... The other night, I couldn't go to sleep. So I was up to, like... I woke up at, like, 3 o'clock. And I was up for the whole day. Boy, Facebook, when you keep scrolling through the videos, boy, that's a dark, dark hole. <laughs> I don't know how this happened. <laughs> but I see like Tiny on uh, like Wendy Williams, and I think this was when um, Tiny and Ti was going through their like divorce phase or whatever the fuck the case was. Yeah, and she had Tiny on her show, and she was just like, "You really didn't mess around with Floyd type shit." And Tiny all the time was like, "No, no, no." And fucking uh, Wendy Williams, she just like, like, bro, you lucky this lady didn't get up and slap the shit out <laughs> because. You're being very fucking disrespectful right now. Yeah, it's been a couple of <laughs> Because she just kept accusing her of, like, uh, sleeping shit. with uh, Floyd or whatever the fuck the case was. Shit, it's been a couple of times she done that to somebody. And then, like, I think. I'm just surprised that nobody ran up on her ass like Charlamagne. Like, like I'm showing up on Charlamagne. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. yeah, uh, yeah, uh, she be out there. She just making all type of assumptions talking about people. I think she had I like, about, she was did, it she Method Man or Method No, it was Method Man. I was just going to say that yeah. it was Method Man. It was his wife or something like that. Yeah, because right? yeah, she like, had said some shit. Like, his, his wife was, like, going through, like, medical shit. And she was, like, like basically, like, talking shit about him and then, like, involving his wife. He's like, yeah. my wife ain't got, sh- like, she'll do what, she'll do about, what yeah. the fuck you talking about. Like, keep keep her name and my name out, the fuck, out, out yeah. your mouth. He's like, I know where you from, cuz. Like, <laughs> we, like, you used to live down the block from me. Who else did Somebody else, Judge Mathis. Yeah, he snapped on that ass at, on, on the radio station. Yeah, because she, she said that she said too. she said some of this stuff shit to him. He's like, we ain't gonna talk about how he used to be a crackhead and do all this no, other no, type of shit. shit. <laughs> I was like, I was like damn, damn. <laughs> Judge Mathis. I was like, man, everybody, everybody got secrets on you. Yeah, so she that's some shit. She ah, oh, that's the other story we got to talk about. Well, this shit funny as fuck. <laughs> but that, uh, that's all I had about Wendy Williams. You had anything else? Nah, nah, yeah, I'm done. Well, yeah. We don't need no more shine. Something funny. El Chapo promises not to kill any jurors. What? <laughs> this is a statement. This is his. He promised not to kill any he, jurors. You know, he has his uh, uh, his, his court his court date or whatever coming up, whatever the case is, and he promises not to kill any jurors for upcoming federal trial. Nah, and I that. read this because it was so short. <laughs> it's so short. <laughs> so I'm just gonna read this whole thing. So a lawyer for El Chapo, whose real name is 
Jaquan Guzman. Come on now. Ads and shit. <laughs> fucking, up, fucking me up. Fucking I'm a reading. People don't think I can't read at home or some shit. <laughs> Bro. Too late. I'll fuck them up. Uh, hey, let's go. Let's go. All right. Okay. So, uh, Jaquan, Jaquan, I don't know how to say the fucking first name, but Guzman uh, filed a motion ask, asking the jurors not to keep their names anonymous or under armed guard. So, did he want these Fuck jurors? That. <laughs> well, look, it says, such special message, he argued, sent a message to the jurors that Guzman is a dangerous and guilty, is dangerous and guilty, and they need to be protected from him. Yeah, Guzman is already suspected <laughs> of trying to have witnesses killed. Killed back. back. Yeah. Uh-huh. And this has the judge says he has to rule on this motion. I'm like, no, uh, fuck that. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> That's all he needed to know that we need to be a motherfucker protected in our names. Be the wrong motherfucker to get jury duty, selected for jury duty. Yeah, this day. is something that he, he decided to promise that's not going to happen this time. <laughs> fuck that. <laughs> I hope there ain't nobody stupid enough to uh, yeah, do that. Fuck that. Uh, you got this goddamn right. I wish I would tell uh, Ella. That's the fucking Mexican cartel. You gonna get found. <laughs> you gonna get found. They gonna cut yeah. your goddamn head off. Yeah. You know, yeah, family, yeah, you all that stuff. Yeah, I'm good. I'm, I'm good. good. Matter of fact, while I'm on this case, well, I don't even want to be here. I'd be like, look. Nigga, if jury duty assigned me to El Chapo's case, my nigga, <laughs> that's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would do everything to get out of that jury duty. I was like, I, Nigga, I, I, I would literally I like, no take a dump on the shit. floor or something. I'm going to go in that motherfucker. <laughs> I know him. Hey, Chapo. <laughs> I let your boy. Some, I'm like, uh, like, I know this nigga. I've seen him before or something. Uh, something. We, we related. Anything. <laughs> I, I'll be damned. <laughs> yeah, boy. I, yeah, that's dead right there, boy. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, oh, another woman that was in the news this week. This is such a hypocritical thing. Tell my Hillary, uh, yeah, Hillary Clinton. Clinton. She said, "Bitches supporting bitches." <laughs> she literally said, "She said that. in a video." Get the fuck out of here! I'll put it on the green screen for everybody at home. But uh, this is just the audio. Please tell me that's a parody. Or no, nigga, like this that. ain't no parody. This is really her. Hey everyone, I just wanted to say thanks. Thanks for your feminism, for your activism. And all I can hope is you keep up the really important good work. <laughs> and let me just say, this is directed to the activist bitches supporting bitches. <laughs> so let's go. Exactly. <laughs> Somebody told her to say it. I don't give a fuck. She's still saying it. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Oh, guess what? Do you say everything somebody tells you to say? Oh, no. <laughs> that motherfucker say bitches supporting bitches. My thing is, why is it always cool for us to call women call other bitches bitches, but we can't call them? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that's what a good cause about, because he said supporting activists, activists and all the other stuff, and the Me Too stuff, but oh, just the fact, that's <laughs> Hillary is a real one. <laughs> if she would have been in office, my nigga, oh, she would have been really than Obama, probably. Especially uh, with some shit like that, my nigga. Bitches supporting bitches, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on, bro. You can't beat that. <laughs> you can't beat that. Oh man. Hey, she a real one. No, nah, she she be killing me. <laughs> she's like a, she's like a somebody's like great grandma or grandma, man. When she yeah. when it comes to like people trying to like have her do current shit. Cause yeah. remember when she was like trying to get motherfuckers to vote and Pokemon Go was like uh popular and she's talking about Pokemon. Yeah, I remember, I remember when she went to uh, the Breakfast Club and they interviewed her. He's like, um, she's like, I keep hot sauce in my bag. Hot sauce in my bag. Yeah. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, really. <laughs> so yeah, Hillary a real one, bro. Don't, 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 don't doubt it. Oh man. Oh man. Like anything to get that black audience. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> it was a lesser of two evils type of vote for me. That's how I took it. Yeah. The uh, worst of evil one, <laughs> unfortunately. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, also, this week, let me look up his fucking name because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say this punk bitch nigga name. Damn. Yeah, he a punk bitch nigga. Um, Rolling with the hell? Larry Nassar. Oh. The, the, the gymnast coach. Gymnast coach, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, uh, man, yeah. that judge. 175 years. 
That's what you get. She was like, nigga, it was over 150 females that got assaulted by this motherfucker over the them, years. Yeah, that was a cool judge. She let them tell their story, you know. Yeah, shit, cause I, I had read this. I, I ain't read this. It was a as fuck. But I had read some of it. It was this gymnast chick. Like, she literally tried to give herself a concussion, my nigga. Like, banging her head against a fucking wall continually just so she could not, like, go to this motherfucker. Stay the fuck away from this dude coaching her and shit. I was like, God damn, that's some wild ass shit. Man, and she, um, I think she broke her ankle. I think somebody on. broke their ankle or some shit like that on purpose so they could stay away from them or some shit like that. Yeah, you've been doing that shit for a long ass Nigga, time. Nigga, it was like 150 girls or some shit like that. It's probably more than that. I can't remember. I can't remember the exact amount of how many girls it was that he was, um. You know, that shit's like some. Nice I asked him what the fuck shit. the case was, but man, that shit was crazy as fuck. Like, but that nigga got 175 years, so. He ain't never get. <laughs> I, don't know, yeah. I don't even know how you give a 50, 60 year old motherfucker 165 years. <laughs> <laughs> don't even put my years on that motherfucker if that's the case. <laughs> like, if I get that old and I, and I go to a fucking judge and you want to say my years, nigga, just say, you got, I see I got life with no motherfucking, with no, uh, <laughs> no, no expectation and no parole. Like, don't put my years out there, bro. Like, 175 years? I don't fucking want to make it to see 100. I'm already, I'm having, I'm damn near, I'm 25% done now. <laughs> so, shit, don't put my number on that motherfucker. Yeah. If I get to that motherfucker, get to that point. That's 175 years. That's a long ass time. That's crazy. So, he got sentenced and shit. Um, yeah, he deserves that, man. Oh, uh, yeah, tonight is the Grammy noms. Grammys. The Grammys man. is tonight, yeah. It yeah, is tonight. yeah, yeah. Um, I don't really care. You don't care about the Grammys? <laughs> Honestly, I don't. Uh, you don't get. I, watch, I, I, I think. I think. Like I do every every award yeah, show. I watch the yeah, performance and I don't leave it at that. Cause I don't, and I, I don't think. Um, uh, it's supposed to be. I, I think. Bruno uh, Mars, Bruno Mars performing. I always want to see that motherfucker. That motherfucker. Icy. I think. What's your name gonna get snubbed too? Who that? Um, Cause he's up for a Grammy for Get Out. Who? Uh, a Grammy or? No, 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 Oscar. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Oscar. I'm not saying. Anything. Um, but no, it's the category with um. I think the honorary. I think Jay Z gonna win whatever category they in because you know Jay Z and Beyonce they don't go to that shit unless they win it. Yeah. So that shit dead to the motherfucker. Um, I'm trying to pull up this 2018 XXL list just so we can make fun because I know yeah, you don't know none care. of these motherfuckers. Yeah. And I want to laugh. Man, when they do that, like, freshman class shit. Like, it don't mean shit no I more like it used to. Yeah. I it used to mean don't. something like Lupe was on it, Kid Cudi, Cudi. Uh, Wale. That was, like, the best year. All best of them people, man. Uh, it was a couple motherfuckers. Like, when they actually used to. Because I know they used to do, like, double XL albums or mixtapes, whatever the fuck the case was. I forgot what the fuck it was. And that's the last time it was actually good. Yeah, I'd be like, who the fuck is this person? Yeah. This ain't the right fucking list. I'm trying to find the fucking list, but... Rappers like Little Dicky, not a Little Dicky. I'm sweet. A uh, little Pump, Little Pump, um, Little Zan, a bunch of Littles. Yeah, all the Littles. <laughs> all the Littles are on the uh, list. I want to. Isn't it crazy how we go right back to uh, people using Little? Yeah. Cause like we had a whole, we had a whole. Uh, I want to say a whole era in the 2000s of people like Little. Then bad, it stopped. It bad stopped, baby. Boy. You know yeah. who bad baby is? Catch me outside, girl. Oh. Catch me outside. How about that? For real? <laughs> yeah. She be rapping and she shit. Rapping. Oh, so wow. she's on that list. Um, it's a bunch of littles. Eh, nobody really gives a fuck about them. Because the list don't really mean shit. No way. It actually used to mean something. So, yeah. Yeah, you said Grammys. I don't know how the fuck you. So I'll say Oscars. Because <laughs> yeah. um, the, the announcement for the Oscars is coming out too. And, um, Somebody gonna get snubbed. Uh, yeah, that's what I was saying. Well, uh, it just passed the Golden Globes, right? That was the Golden Globes. It just passed that right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah cause, um, Get Out is supposed to get one. Oh, well, it's good. nominated for one. You know what I just figured it's out? Like a, um, it's like a couple movies. In have there. you it's seen, been, have you seen, fuck, what's the name of that movie? I just saw that movie on the list somewhere. It's a it's an old movie. You're next. You're next. Have you uh, seen that movie? Uh, it's when a girl. I, um, I think the girl boyfriend takes her to like a family to a family, and they go on like a retreat to a house every year or some shit like that. Mm-hmm. And they find like she's this super killer assassin type bitch because they try to kill her or some shit. 
Movie's like two, three years old. No, no, no you never seen that shit. That it's something, it's something like that, but it's some the family trying to kill her or some shit like that, or trying to kill, trying to kind of sacrifice her, or some shit like that. I don't really remember. I was like, damn, this kind of looks like Get Out. <laughs> I'm like, man, did you like Get Out? Yeah, I love Get Out. I didn't. You didn't like Get Out? No. Get out of here. I swear to God, don't I'm to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, I got what was going on, but it wasn't that good for me. I, I like I it. got it. Like, I understood. There's a lot of deep shit in there. If you break it, like, you break everything down. Every That's, probably what I need. That's probably what I need to do or watch it again. Because yeah. I, I watched, but I was like, man, it's just, it's okay. I get the sunken place and all that type of shit. And, you know, yeah, I, I, I just didn't, I just didn't, I wasn't fucking really. Yeah, I like, I like that. I was like, I was like, that was so good, I was skeptical at first. I was like, mm, cause it's like I, I'm not big uh, uh, King of the Tale. Um, I can deal with the like two three minute clips I watch fan. from wherever. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm not I, a can't big watch, fan. I, I never watch like a full episode of King of the Tale. I have yeah. no clue what they do on a full episode. I I never watch the full episode or nothing. I see like the clips. And it's like the same clips over and over, like when Obama is shaking all the brothers' hands <laughs> and he's dapping them up and he gets the right. white people, he get uh, real sophisticated type shit. Yeah. Other than that, I haven't really seen no Ken Peel clips. Yeah, because like, I mean, I, I've seen some of their stuff and some of it be funny and then some of it just don't be like funny to me. But like, I, I don't know, I wasn't a big fan I, when I had heard like he was making a movie. I, I just assumed it was going to be like a funny movie because like they did, did I, they, did they Keanu come before? Um, I did see Keanu. Keanu came, came before, before get, out. get Out. Oh, did it come after? I don't remember. I, I can't. Remember. I can't, I can't remember, remember. But I just remember. I did watch Keanu though. I did watch that. That was okay. That wasn't that funny to me either. Yeah, that's 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 what I thought. I assumed Get Out was gonna be like that before, like I actually seen the trailer and stuff. Yeah. And yeah. Like, and I was like, okay, I'll give it a watch. I was like, this looks, looks, looks interesting. Yeah. So. Uh, no, he did. Yeah, he did a good job on that. I don't know what the fuck we was talking about that. We got some Keanu in. <laughs> <laughs> Ken Bill. Yeah, we're talking about Ken Bill. Uh, but yeah, so I think that's all the main stuff is. Um, would you like to talk about. I got a few sports news. Would you like to talk sports, Mike? Let's talk sports. Do you know who sports. Jamel Hill is? Sports. You know who Jamel Hill is? No clue? Alright, she has this show. I forgot the name. But she has this show on either. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, whoa! Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> um. So yeah, anyway, she has she's leaving Sports Center for a new position at ESPN. Um. I think she's already on ESPN, but she has this debate show with like her and a guy. And they started from YouTube or like either they was podcasting or something like that too. And ESPN picked them up. And like a few months back, um, she had said some shit about Trump. Nah, uh, On the show. No, no, no. This was a while ago, and she got um. <laughs> and I think she got suspended for like a week or something like that. Oh, but then she I came did, back and then she I doubled know. down on that shit. Yeah. <laughs> or some shit like that. And like this is this is like part of the reason I don't watch shit on ESPN period no more. I don't I, I haven't watched NFL game all year. I've been boycotting the NFL and I haven't been boycotting ESPN. I haven't watched the NFL game all oh, fucking year. Man. Like period. I haven't watched a game, period. Mm-hmm. The only reason I know who's playing as who bowl because motherfuckers talking oh. work. And as it, I haven't watched that shit. I've been boycotting. That's how you boycott people. You don't watch the, <laughs> don't shit. Watch the shit. That's how you boycott. And I haven't watched ESPN after she got like she got disciplined. Some shit I forgot. I forgot exactly what happened, but she got yeah, disciplined because she said something about Trump. And yeah, then like, all dude. the Secret Service and shit sent them a letter or some shit like that. Some other shit went down. They suspended her for speaking her mind on because I guess when she worked for ESPN, you know ESPN is just like this. When you under all that shit, they've been to pretty much on you, on your Twitter, on everything. You say, yeah, because that was on her and personal. That's what yeah, on her Twitter. personal Twitter. She had said some shit. I forgot, I forgot what she said. I, I remember that. Uh, that was a while back. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was yeah. a while, while back. Because, so, like, she got she got suspended the first time for saying something. Yeah, and I know. think she got suspended then again she, got she doubled sp- down. Yeah, she, she doubled got, down on what the fuck she said. <laughs> she she so, got suspended again the second time. Yeah, so, so I, that happened. Okay. And now she's taking a new position at uh, ESPN. I'm not sure what the position is, but hopefully it's... I mean, she's still owned by the same conglomerate. Yeah, that's my, that's my <laughs> thing, too. I thought, I thought she was switching networks or some shit. I didn't know what the fuck was going on. Yeah, I mean, you... you you just going from one room to another. But yeah, but congratulations to her. But like, I started watching ESPN. I, I boycotted that and I boycotted NFL. Like, yeah, fuck the NFL. <laughs> and since we saying fuck the NFL, Malcolm, you know what's coming back? What's that? Oh, extra. Yeah. <laughs> I, Extreme Football extreme. League. 
<laughs> I, I, when I saw that shit, I, saw I went that, to YouTube. I was like, I was like oh my "What God. the fuck was XFL?" And I went back. I was like, "Oh yeah, god damn that shit old as fuck." <laughs> yeah. That like that's the league where you can put whatever whatever name you want on the back of your jersey or some shit. I think one of my fucking names was like, "Wow, they had like different yeah. rules and shit." So, yeah. That was wild. Yeah, so that's coming back thanks to uh, Steve McMahon or is it, is it Steve? McMahon. I think it's Steve McMahon. I forgot which one it was. It's it's a McMahon, <laughs> whatever the fuck his name is. Yeah. So he's bringing that he shit did, back. Yeah, he did like a video talking yeah. about it and shit, and I was like, oh wow. Yeah. He already uh that shit ain't, that shit ain't gonna last. That that shit ain't gonna last. I don't know. It's but a it's a good climate. A, but a lot of people saying that it's it's a perfect time for him to do it because a lot of people like. Not watching kind, NFL. Yeah, or they kind of like you. They yeah. they not watching because like in NFL they like their numbers. Are down. I mean, I've been kind of all right not just watching football. Anymore. Yeah, <laughs> I think I can live without <laughs> watching football. <laughs> Whoever the fuck it is playing, they sound like me. Yeah, I, I think I can survive. <laughs> I love I love playing sports. Don't get me wrong, I don't love playing sports. I watch it every once in a while. But I I'm, love, not, I'm not like a sports. heavy. I'm not like a heavy. I don't think I ever really watch football like that, like that though. Yeah, I don't really know. I play like and all we play, we play like yeah. motherfucker, but I don't think I ever just like sat down and watched it. Like, yeah, I'll, I'll watch it. I'll watch the game every now and then, like if we're in the bar. I only watch. I only, or, I only watch basketball when it's playoff time. Yeah, <laughs> All Star Weekend and playoff time. That's the only time I watch basketball. Like, I'm not, I'm not tuning in for y'all preseason games. <laughs> I'm not tuning in. I'm not tuning in for ninety two fucking games. That shit's dead. <laughs> like, that's not that's not me. Especially not the fucking Bulls. So yeah, that shit's dead. They suck. It's the truth. I don't even watch basketball. I know that. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> it's the fucking truth. They got rid of every goddamn body down there. Um, let's see. We got some tech news too, my phone. Yeah. Would you like to talk some tech news? Yeah, let's talk tech. iPhone X is already getting killed. Oh, <laughs> they already. They getting rid of that motherfucker already. already. That's the that's what they kind of get. So how you gonna jump from eight to to ten? And that they're getting <laughs> that's the only reason they're getting rid of it. They're getting rid of it just because they have a new line of phones coming out this year. The nine, let me guess, nine. No, it didn't, it didn't say, but it's like, well, we're gonna get rid of the ten. So like, if you all have an iPhone ten, you got a limited edition phone because that shit can be killed the fuck off. I don't know if it's gonna get software updates anymore, but I know the whole. I think I have a theory to the whole reason that they getting rid of this motherfucker. Because you know the little animal emoji thing? Yeah. Uh, that's a whole other company that owns that shit. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Apple kind of stole, 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 stole that shit. They and I'm assuming, shit. I'm assuming that's why they killing that shit off. That's just my theory, people. I'm not sure if that's true or not. But that's the reason I think they're getting rid of that motherfucker. So, you're ready for a new iPhone. Just standing y'all ass in line like some dumbasses. I, I, I ain't. I, like, I, although I do have an Apple phone, I'm not like an Apple fanatic. Mm-hmm. When oh, that's something else with Apple, too. They um they getting rid- that's something else they getting rid of, the um, one of the Max. Uh, I forgot I which know. one. You can get that motherfucker. You can get that um for the for the little little Malcolm. What's that? Damn, is it the Air Max? Oh yeah, that was a bad idea to begin with. Yeah, they getting rid of them. They um yeah, cause like you they have discontinuing to, them motherfuckers. Yeah, you basically have to buy fucking ports for the fucking thing. That's the, I thought that yeah, yeah, yeah. was stupid. Yeah, so yeah, too. MacBook Air. So they're getting rid of them. MacBook Air, yeah. So now you can get your computer, brother. For the low low. No, not no that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I do want to, I do want to upgrade my computer shit. Uh, not a not a MacBook Pro. Yeah, they put that. I mean, uh, MacBook Air. Air. So yeah, they putting that motherfucker to sleep, as in clear day says in the fucking uh, title of the article. <laughs> so yeah, they're getting rid of that. Um, so Apple also doing something else. I forgot what the. They're doing something else. I know last week we talked about Netflix, but they just said they're doing something else, too. Um, also, uh, I didn't write this in the notes, but Facebook is thinking about jumping into the YouTube and Twitch um, Feel. video game and stream field. And guess who was the first nigga to sign right. up for that shit? Who? This guy. Oh, you signed up <laughs> for yeah. Because uh, during the monetization, you know, like, YouTube got the monetization fucked up right now. Yeah. Twitch don't really monetize unless you have like a certain amount of views and yeah, subscribers yeah, and shit like that. Kind of like a you can get a good, shit, good yeah. follower following. And I think Facebook said like shit, like when you get a off rip, they're going to make sure they uh, monetize your videos and shit like that. So it's in beta or alpha, or, I mean, not, not alpha, in beta. beta. 
But um, but yeah, that's on the way. I seen the link, brother. You can sign up too. <laughs> get that money. Get the money. Man. Get the bag. And, uh, get the fuck out of here. I'm looking forward to playing. Uh, what's that monster? Um, oh, it's on the world. Monster Hunter. Yeah. yeah, I really want to play that too, but yeah, I don't know. Play that. it. Hey, play it together. Shit. Yeah, my nigga. Get PlayStation. Something. Get PlayStation together. Uh, let's see. What else do we have on the list? I'm gonna make sure I get past all the other stories before we get to these other shits. Let's see how many we got for these trailers. Yeah. So, um. Man, it's been so far. I've seen the trailers. It's been so hard. I'm gonna cover them. Cover my eyes. fucking eyes. Dude, they been dropping so many. They, oh, they my so God. Many so many, my nigga. It's That's so why hard. I, I like, <laughs> no, no. I'm like a little ass kid. I no. Been wa- and all I do is watch reaction videos. Like, bro, That's bro. all they've been watching is fucking I'm like, Black Panther. got two weeks, two weeks before yeah. the movie come out, bro. Like, yeah, you, you, already, you already trying to ruin them fucking movie for me. Yeah. I was like, I already expected that. I was like, that's why I haven't been, because uh, I know you want to, uh, you was talking about uh, checking out uh, what was that? Uh, what's that movie? Uh, oh. Yeah, that, that you was you had texted me that uh, you. Oh, Den of Thieves. Den of Thieves. Yeah, you yeah. Check that out, and I know you go to a fucking movie. It's a it's, it's a trailer. It's a nine out of ten chance <laughs> that we go see it's a, a Black Panther trailer. trailer. Like, and it's gonna no, be the new one. I don't want to so see it. I don't want to see it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm rolling that bitch ten minutes late. <laughs> ten minutes late, so I know. No, bro, bro, in the movie. Thing, I got a text his ass. Hey, bro, you can see. Yeah, it's safe to go I, I, ain't, I ain't trying to ruin this movie for me, man. I have a, I have a two, I have a two trailer rule. Like oh, one, you, the, the one, the first trailer, I, I the first like trailer much, uses man. promo, promo. Like they don't make them that long. That's fine. Right, like, right. I'll, I'll be that happy with those. The little teaser trailer yeah. that they normally make. Then when the first initial trailer come out, after that I'm done with trailers. I I want I want to spoil the movie for myself because if I do, I was like I can't turn. I went to film school, so I can't turn this film shit off. <laughs> so like if, if you give me a fucking trailer of who what when when why, I already figured out the fucking movie before <laughs> I ain't well, seen it. Yeah, and I, and yeah. you know used to me seeing it because I already yeah. know how everything's going on. That's what happened with the Star Wars, the last Star Wars. I was like, yeah, you know, I seen too much. Like I already know. Like yeah, that's why I didn't. I, that's like, yeah, that was <laughs> when that came out. Like I made it. I made. I made sure I didn't see any more trailers because yeah, I already fuck, knew that, that was gonna spoil it for me. That definitely fucked me up too. Um, but since we're talking about comic books, <laughs> you know the new Venom movie is coming out eventually, right? Yeah. Tom Hardy, Tom Hardy, he's playing them. Um, at first, they were saying that the Spider-Man wasn't going to be in there. Now they have confirmed Spider-Man. So they put Spider-Man in it. Yeah, they put him in there. So I don't know how this is going to work. I don't know what's going to happen. But also, we have another Houseway. Spidey in there. Well, not really Spidey, but Carnage. Carnage. Uh-oh. So now Carnage is going to be in there. And I mean, also, if you. One more person <laughs> that I've never even heard of. I don't know if you probably heard of. You probably read more comments to me. The Red Goblin. There's a Red Goblin in there. Yeah, so he's gonna be in there too. That's why I'm gonna in this. Yeah. Uh, in this in this one movie. Yeah, in one movie. And I don't know. I know. I know. It was a comic or something. Like Venom was ended up being like the good guy, like anti-hero type. A person, um, I think he had like a team or some shit or something like that. I'm not sure. I, I don't know the fucking facts. Okay, it would it would make sense for Carnage. Yeah, Carnage. Carnage. Carnage makes sense, yeah. Yeah, Carnage and Venom, that makes sense. Yeah, they exactly. Both, they both, like, symbiotes. Symbiotes. Type shit, yeah. Yeah. I, I understood that, that. that. Yeah, that makes and sense. And I never heard of Red Goblin, but I'm assuming it's just Carnage mixed I mean, with the yeah. Red, Red Goblin. I don't fucking know. Yeah. That's just what I'm assuming. <laughs> so uh, now, now that they said the identity is Spider confirmed. Man in there too? <clears throat> and they said Spider Man is confirmed to be in there too. Yeah, so I don't yeah, know what the fuck is going to happen. Sony is going to. Oh man, it's gonna make a Sony be, movie. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a repeat. It's gonna be a. I hope it's not a fucking. Please, so, yeah. I hope it's not a fucking repeat of so, uh, Spider-Man Three. Please, I swear to God, with the Venom. Oh yeah, 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 with uh, that Venom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was yeah. horrible. Yeah, I don't know. I was so that. disappointed. And I was, I was happy out because like I love Venom, man. That's like, that's my man. Yeah, it's a lot going. It's a lot happening in that movie now. It's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot, man. Cause like I can see, cause like I could even have I to could introduce them to I could Spider-Man. Even understood Spider-Man and just Venom. I could yeah, I could that. understand that. Especially like, if they did it, the especially if they did it with Marvel again, like they like they've been doing or whatever. But I think this is a straight Sony project because this is a straight Venom movie. 
So I don't know how this shit gonna turn out. Period. Yeah, no, it's gonna turn out either, but it's a lot of characters. And if they uh, trying to do that, just like you said, Spider Man Three. But if they trying to do like the the one before the Homecoming, whatever, the Amazing Spider Man. Yeah. They started trying to set up the Sinister Sticks. Yep. If they trying to do some shit like that too, that shit gonna fail also. Just like Amazing Spider Man Two, or whatever the case is. So I don't know how that shit's gonna turn out. I just think it's too many people, uh-huh. especially for motherfuckers who haven't read comic books. You don't know who the fuck the Red Goblin is. Cause I damn sure don't know. And I've been watching Spider Man since Spider Man, yeah, and I've been playing all the games and all the other shit, and I've never seen a Red Goblin. So I don't have no clue who the that's, fuck a Red Goblin. Is. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <clears throat> so it's a lot of backstory to be tracked. Yeah, that's it's that's, a lot that's of it's I'm a saying, lot of story because like, you still even got to do the Venom story also. Yeah, because I'm like you. Because even if you just you can't just pop up Venom, and then you can't even just pop up Venom because then you gotta you also gotta do the symbiote coming to the fucking Earth or whatever the fuck the case is too. So yeah. it's a lot. Of shit like, you that, do. Yeah, that's why I said I understand. And then it got to hit Spider Man too. Yeah, <laughs> first, and then it has to be released to motherfucking um uh, whatever the fuck the uh. Fucking name is I don't know I can't even think of his name. Other photographer, whatever the fuck his name is, they got to release him. So that's a lot of story just in between to get to Venom. So I don't know how you gonna get to Venom, then the Carnage, then the, the Red the Red Goblin, all that fuck the case is. It's a lot to cover. That's all I'm saying. They probably got their hands full with that one. So yeah, I'm calling bullshit early. <laughs> I'm a I'm a wait and see. Wow. But yeah, that's a long while from now. Yeah, shit, I'm still I'm still fucking waiting on uh, uh fucking uh Shazam. Oh, <laughs> uh, you know they dropped some um some Captain I Marvel know they, Captain Marvel this week, right? What pictures? Yep. Yeah. With, uh Brie Larson. Or Brie Larson, what Brie Larson, yeah. She dropped them. They, she, she I know they dropped the pictures. Right? They dropped the video too. It's like a little like teaser. A little clip. Not even a teaser, it's just like some all on set type shit. Oh. So they dropped that clip too. But I mean, that looks good. Yeah. Just That's all what Marvel. <laughs> yeah, they trying to Yeah, they trying to they just Marvel trying to get this um Infinity Wars out the way. Yeah, that should drop all the rest of these movies and shit. Yeah, cuz um cuz it's a couple of, what what's coming out this year. Black Panther, Ant-Man and Wasp. Or whatever the fuck it is. It's Wasp, right? Ain't that it? Mhm. Um fuck else is coming. Something else coming out from Marvel too. I can't think of it. I don't know. It's something. Yeah, because it's something else coming out. There's a couple Marvel movies coming out this year though. So yeah, that's what's happening there. Um, I want Yeah, I know. I meant. <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant to say. It because like what? No, you said it right, Captain Marvel. Because because um. I used to think of Shazam, you meant Cap- Captain Marvel? Yeah, I meant, yeah, I meant Captain Marvel when I was talking about it. I was like, because, like, you know, they, the whole reason why, because yeah. they, the fucking names and shit. And then, uh, <laughs> uh, I think Because Miss Marvel all. wasn't Miss Marvel. I think that's all. I want to say that's tired. all. <laughs> You've been moving and shit today, my nigga. <laughs> don't bring your ass over after you got done moving. Uh, hey, man, I don't got no more of that shit in me. Um, I was gonna say you get a new DLC for Assassin's Creed. Yes. More shit for you to play. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that 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 uh, dropped a couple of days ago. I think that's all. Yep. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think that's all. Uh, got trailers. Oh yeah. Uh, don't have really no good trailers either, by the way. We just got um, let's see, what do we have? We got the God of War story trailer. About time. Yes. About time they have another. I was have you watched it yet? So excited! Yes, you did. You yes, did. <laughs> I watched it. I watched it. I watched it. One of my homies sent, sent it to me, and I was like, "Yes," <laughs> because like we had talked about it, and we was like, "They pushed it back." I gotta watch it because. And I was man. like, "Wait!" I was like, "Wait!" He's like, "He's like, yeah, it's coming out in the next month." I was like, "Are you sure?" Because they pushed it. I was like, "They pushed the date, the the, the date back." He's yeah. like, "No, they didn't." He's like, "They pushed it up." I was like. Uh, Wait, let me see the trailer. So yeah, we got that trailer. We got the Deep Blue C two trailer. No LL Cool J, I'm pretty sure. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, let's do that one first. No Sam Jackson may make it. Uh, we also got the Pacific Rim Uprising trailer. Oh, we got another one. Yeah, you know they dropped another one. They dropped another one. Yeah. Uh, I heard good things about it too, by the way. And yeah, 
Oh, before we start the trailers, uh, do you like Cloverfield? Or did you like Cloverfield? I just rewatched the first. I hated that fucking movie. I didn't get the first. Okay, did we go through movies to see Cloverfield? Nah. Back in the day. Uh, that was that was way before Cloverfield. Like, no, that was Cloverfield, my nigga. We went to go see because it was. I think it was me, you, do man, and like probably, probably Marlon or some shit. I don't remember. I think we went to go see. I, when I went with somebody, we ended up walking out. Okay. <laughs> That's nah, why I said Cloverfield nah. was out for a long time ago. No, nah, then. And I was like, what the fuck is this? Yeah, we were trying to see what the fuck we just watched. That's that same way I feel. I think we did. No, nah, you know what? I think I, I did. I think we did. I, I think I did. I think I ended up. I think I ended up I seeing it twice, but yeah, well, I, yeah, I didn't like it. So I watched it like a while, while ago, probably like last year. You liked it? Uh, no, I didn't like Cloverfield. <laughs> but it was another one that had just dropped with um the guy from Roseanne. I forgot his fucking name. Uh, yeah, that's a different one. That, that, yeah, 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 that was that's the uh, same little universe, whatever the case is. But yeah, that one was that one was thing makes, happened. That I, I, makes, I watched that, yeah. but now they um talking about making it a series. Which one? I don't know. <laughs> if it's Cloverfield, I don't know. If it's Cloverfield, it says Clover, it says Netflix circling Cloverfield sequel. Uh, Gar, God, particle, yeah, God particle. Okay, I, I was thinking protocol. So I don't know. So I don't even know if that's gonna be a movie or a series, but it's gonna be called God uh, particle. Yeah, cause the. So I don't know because the first one was kind of trash. Suck. <laughs> I know so many people. Yeah, that it. was like the like the. I don't know. I was about to say that's like the Blair Witch era, but that wasn't even the Blair Witch era. That no. shit old as fuck. Cause Blair Witch is older than that shit. That shit was like two two thousands. Yeah, that's that's the early two thousands. Yeah, it was like that. Um, I don't know what the fuck to call that shit. What is that? Like shaky cam or some shit like that. Oh, you talking about the uh, just how I shot away the fucking movie. first person <laughs> or some shit like that? What the fuck is called? I don't know. POV. <laughs> yeah, POV. What the, fuck is, what the fuck is called? I don't know. Oh yeah. Uh, if it ain't like the one that just happened, I'll pass on it. I don't. I don't need to see another cold film. No, yeah, that was like that's. <laughs> Yeah, that, that pissed me off. I, I didn't like that movie. So, yeah. So, let's get uh, into these. This shit, bro. I gave it to Malcolm. I gave it to Malcolm. They show something. That was man. fucking time, though, my nigga. God damn. I'm so <laughs> fucking excited about this, bro. And, and it seems like from the trailer or, like, the sense of story that, man, this motherfucker is going to basically be another fucking Kratos. Like, so, you think they're going to kill Kratos? Do you no, think the god dies? I don't, I don't think so. Do you what think I think, he dies? I what think, I think, yeah. what I think is gonna happen because like, he, does Obi Wan die? We, we t- <laughs> <laughs> remember we talked about how the creator said they're not stopping that uh, Nordic. Yeah, 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 yeah. They go on like they Egyptian on and, and all that shit. Yeah. So they still just die. The only how to how his mom died. What if? I guess it's part of the story. Though. What if this yeah. motherfucker um made like his own circle, his own kids. So his all, all his kids all his is his new c- circle and shit. Oh, like shit. he got he got one from the hey, be lit. yeah he got, <laughs> he got right <laughs> he he basically got one from the Nordic gods. So like if he if, so he uh, if his shorty kills all the Nordic gods, he'd be like the Nordic god, and then like you know another one be like for the Egyptians, yeah, yeah, and then yeah, another yeah. one for such and such, hey. and such and such and such and such. Malcolm's yeah. been thinking people. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that trailer had me thinking, bro. Yeah, I was like, oh man, Malcolm's been thinking. I was like, man, that was crazy. Malcolm doesn't that. want God of War to end ever. <laughs> <laughs> don't get me wrong, I, I like a good story and good play. Now I don't want them to like milk it. But like if it's good, I'll keep playing. It shows some. I still need to see some fucking gameplay though. You want to see gameplay? Some real actual gameplay. Cause I just I don't I see how I don't see how I don't know. You don't it's see not, how it's not like the old. It's, work. it's like not yeah. I want to see that too, but it's not it's like uh, not like the old one, like the old God of War. Yeah, because, I mean, he was so little dolo. He was out that anger. <laughs> yeah, he still seemed angry. He no, seemed angry. He's, he seemed a lot calmer now com- compared to, like, how he was. I'm pretty sure the story would be good, though. Last year, yeah. Because it, 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 seem, it seems like this... He, that's, that's, what, that's what I'm getting from Trey. Like, it seems like history is kind of, like, repeating itself. Mm-hmm. Something must have fucked up happened with the kid because the kid was angry and shit, too. He was like, rip your fucking head off! Yeah. He was screaming at like so he was probably screaming at one of those fucking gods. Probably so that's why he was yeah. like, "Hey, chill, bro. You, <laughs> you, <laughs> you know what happened when you kill gods? He's yeah. like, when you kill gods, you fuck up a whole lot of shit. Yeah. He's like, how the fuck do you know? Right. Like, shit, your damn old ass down. You don't know. Right. It's like, no, nah, you only knew, bro. Let's see. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, April eighteenth, right? Ain't that what's it? April twentieth. 
Twenty. Yeah. I'll bet. I'm gonna bet. All right, well, we'll see. We'll see. Get to play with Kratos skin. It's gonna be some bad <laughs> Um, uh, and I think that is all, people. Yeah. Off rip, I'm starting on hard mode. Off rip? Like you Off rip, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, I think that's it. I want to say that's it. That's it for the trailers. That's, that's it for everything. That's it for the podcast. I right. everything, my nigga. We do it. Cool. Almost. <laughs> um, yeah, that's it. So that's all the notes. That's all I got in the notes. The news. Cool. All the news. Kelly, we down with bitches and bitches. <laughs> bitches supporting bitches. Bitches supporting bitches. She with the shits. I think that was funny as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> um, she so, like, yeah. The way she looked at the camera, too, was like, is that all right to say that? Mm-hmm. I think she looked right at the camera bitches and said, bitches. bitches supporting bitches. Bitches supporting bitches. All right. Yeah, this is what all these right. young people saying. Yeah. So, yeah, that's it. All yeah. right. Anything you want to close out with, Malcolm? No. No, nothing. Nothing in the plug. Nothing. Uh, no. 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 All right, then, bro. Uh, I don't think I have anything. Yeah, you don't have your little jokes no more. Like my rap jokes. Yeah. I can't Get think of one. Your jokes. I can't think of one on the spot. Oh, you, we, we already talked about funny, crazy niggas in here. So. Yeah. I guess we was doing that when it was dry. We had some laughs today. Hey, yeah. Big laughs. Oh yeah. Uh, so yeah, I guess we're gonna close out. Boom. Uh, follow us everywhere. Yep. <laughs> Twitter. Twitter. Two dads with dreads. Facebook. Uh, Dread Dads Podcast. SoundCloud. Dread Dads Podcast. iTunes. Dread Dads Podcast. Instagram. YouTube. Dread Dads Podcast. Instagram. Dread Dads Podcast. Um. Yeah. So this has been another episode of Dread Dance Podcast. My name is Clint. My name is Val. And we out this bitch. Woo!